in the name of Allah, the most beneficent and the most merciful. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I'm here in the village of Chapas and I'm, I have the honor of visiting one of our brothers in the community, Brother Yahya and his family. They were gracious enough to invite me to their home and I thought this would be a good opportunity for me to show Muslims all over the world the kinds of humble settings, mashallah, these brothers live in. They were gracious enough to allow me to record how they live, mashallah, him and his uh, three sons and one daughter, right? Three sons and three sons and uh, one daughter, mashallah, live in this house and here you can see the house itself and I wanted to show you how graciously they invited me inside. I'd like you to take a look yourself too, inshallah. Hmm. This is their home, subhanAllah. They're a happy family with whatever Allah has given them, subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is their kitchen, their eating area. And on the other side, these curtains that you're going to see in a second. Uh, this is, yeah, this, these curtains you see over here, this is where they sleep. Behind these curtains is where they sleep. This is all of their bedding. A family of six, mashallah. And this is how they live. Let me show you out to their bed. Yeah, and this, this is the floor. You should take a look at this floor. SubhanAllah, I even asked them when it rains, there's a flood in here, but they are sort of on an elevation, so the water goes outside. And if you can notice the panels on the wall, there's actually sunlight coming through there, so the only way they're keeping water out is by this plastic covering. I mean, if you look at the ceiling, SubhanAllah, we have, people have, in the United States, we have garages that don't have ceilings like this. And here, mashallah, they're living in this home. SubhanAllah, how Allah is the razi, how we don't deserve what we have. And, you know, they, they, they're given this risk and they're happy and people have 10 times as much and they're not happy. SubhanAllah. This Praise is here. This is his prayer room and his bedroom, mashallah. SubhanAllah. Jazakallah khairan. I'm just so humbled by <laughs> just the level of contentment these people have. Now, they don't ask for anything. It's, it's amazing. They don't ask for anything. They're just such hospitable people. And such gracious people, they're, ever since I've gotten here, I've only seen brotherhood and love and subhanAllah. And even when they asked, they didn't ask for money, they just asked for groceries. You know, they didn't even ask for like any monetary amount. And let me show you the restroom. The bathroom. So the entire family. And this is the condition of the entire uh, uh, community. Pretty much all of them have this sort of a bathroom setting. The shack outside the house is their bathroom. Allah, you, you see this stuff and it makes you realize when, when Allah gives risk and we're ungrateful, you know? We live in a society where we open the fridge and we're like, oh, there's no Pepsi. And we start complaining, <laughs> you know? Look at these people, and they're not complaining. They're happy with how they are, subhanAllah. And the, his sons even came out when I was, we were putting food together and the packets together for the community in the masjid and inshallah maybe in another video I'll give you a little tour of the masjid you know they came and they helped and they're so excited to, you know to see our faces and they're so friendly and wonderful Make, makes you want to make so much dua for them so I want you to remember these families especially with the Yahya's family and the entire community's families in your duas and make dua that Allah unites them and keeps their family strong and strong on the deen they're the only Muslims here in the area you know I mean some statistics even say of the millions of people that live in Mexico what 3700 or less are Muslims so they're very, very, very small minority. People don't know about Islam here. And inshallah ta'ala, these people not only prosper themselves, and may Allah make better and better means of risk for them, but they become a source of uh, da'wah to Islam in this land. So please be a part of supporting this community as, be as best you can. And as you watch this, I would urge you to watch this over and over again to remind yourself the kind of setting you live in, and how Allah gives and Allah takes away. Barakallahu li wa lakum. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Gracias.